So next figurative language we're going to talk about is figurative language. So here there's a lot of metaphor that compares the woman's marriage to enslavement. The connection here is pretty obvious. Just like slaves are bound to enslavement by their chains, so is a woman bound to oppression due to the enslaving nature of her marriage. So here we'll argue metaphor. supports the message because it mirrors the idea that marriage is enslaving to women. Now we have to get specific. Just like slaves are bound to enslavement by their chains, women are bound to their oppression. from the enslaving nature of marriage.